Welcome back to the shop. This is just going to be a brief update video. Um, there hasn't been an awful lot of work going on. I do have a video pending right now for a couple of mallets I made up for potential donations as giveaways in some upcoming challenges uh, around YouTube. So watch out for those. Um, I missed the opportunity to do the play button challenge for the small shop woodworkers challenge on Facebook. Uh, my kid did draw the play button outline that we're going to use and when I get an opportunity to actually do that, I'm probably going to just have it in the background anyways. Uh, I've seen a couple of different mentions of a challenge flying around um, for the May the 4th be with you, uh, you know, Star Wars Day coming up next month. If anybody knows exactly where you can enter into this or if there's like a giant playlist going on, please put it in the description down below. I know it's on Instagram, it's all over Facebook, it's been all over YouTube and nobody really seems to be using the same name and there's a couple of different people who are promoting it but nobody's really kind of taking charge of it and I'm certainly not in it. So let me know where I can uh, submit there. I do have a project in mind. I found a really cool map of a Star Destroyer and I'm going to be working on that. It's going to be a really unique challenge for me. Um, there's a lot of angles involved that I haven't tried before. So as a new woodworker, this is going to be a lot of fun. And uh, let's see, anything else changing around the shop? Oh, uh, the other day we were bringing our trash up to the transfer station and found this <laughs> uh, tripod hanging out there along with two others, the one that that camera's sitting on right now, and a brand new one, tag still on it and everything that I gave to my wife for her camera. Um, so, Interestingly enough, I've got three new tripods, which is fabulous, and they're all for free. Um, I do have a small uh, GoPro knockoff coming in the mail in a week or two, and I'm going to test that out and see if we can get some interesting other angles and do some other uh, types of videos as well. Uh, I'm not sure if any of you guys are really into these kind of like, you know, updates and vlog things, so if you are, you know, let me know, give me a thumbs up, like, share, and subscribe. Uh, of course, you know, Leave comments down below. I'm always looking to hear from you guys. If there's interesting things that you want me to try or that you've seen somebody else do, you want me to go check it out. I'm all about it. Um, some of those things are pretty advanced for, for a guy like me, and I'll be the first to admit that I will love watching it and not always have the opportunity to go out there and try it. Um, but I will do my best in some of these things. Uh, right now, I'm going to be working on this, this Star Destroyer, and I think that's going to eat up the majority of my time for the next week or two while I iron out all the details on it. I think this is going to be the board. Uh, I got a rough outline on there. This is just kind of um, freehanded, really. I, I didn't have any measurements on it. I, I've got some measurements now uh, from a really good plan. I'm, I'm hoping that they, they will line up with kind of what I've got going on here. Uh, my biggest worry is that, that uh, peak in the middle, down the whole length of the ship. Um, my, my intention is to tilt my table saw blade and make those cuts first, the, the inside and outside cut for it, see if they'll line up together and make the angle I want. If they do, then I will start cutting the edges uh, so that I can get, you know, that, that big uh, triangle shape for that. Any tips on that would be fabulous, please. Again, lots and lots of suggestions are welcome. Um, New tools in the shop, not so much. Uh, haven't really been looking for an awful lot. I think I've got everything I need right now. And then, of course, there's always opportunity to add more. But I think the next tool for the shop is going to be a marking gauge. I'm probably going to make one. Um, I saw one the other day, fairly inexpensive at Harbor Freight. I like it. I mean, you know, they're not you know, rocket science or anything, so they shouldn't be that expensive. But I really like the idea of possibly making my own. So I'm going to go diving through the scrap bin and see what I can find that I want to play with and see if I can't do some kind of really cool animation for the beam 
and maybe use some of that leftover maple that I've got for the main uh, fence and body of it. Um, I haven't decided if I'm going to go with like a blade style versus a, a nail or not. If there's a preference you guys have out there, why? Again, leave me another comment. Our Facebook page is growing a little bit. Be sure to look us up there and, and like our page there if you could. Uh, sometimes stuff makes it there that doesn't always make it onto YouTube and Instagram for sure. So at this point, I think I'm going to go back to editing uh, the other film and see if I can get that up sometime in the next 24 to 48 hours. I really appreciate all the support and the ongoing encouragement that you guys give us. It's just been wonderful, you know, and the amount of folks who are really interested in us on Facebook has been just over the top. It's new for us to, to have this much attention on what we do. We're just playing around, we're learning these things, and I'm by no means an expert. I'm really not even here to, to teach much of anything other than that you can go out here and do this stuff if you want to take a few minutes and learn it, and uh, don't be afraid to screw it up and go back and try again and again and again. So. Thanks for hanging out with us. I hope to see you back here soon. Have a great one.